Welcome everyone. It's group B. Week 3, I think, match between Varialis and Safer, and I got Michael with me. Hello, everyone. Uh, it's very important match. Uh, I think Borealis is currently fighting for top 1 position in his group. Cypher meanwhile lost to Komori and he is fighting for any points he can get. Uh, but those are very strong uh, players in their groups, so we will see. Uh, starting with Root Canal, what are your expectations, Michael? My expectations are that we'll definitely see some good preparation from the players because I know both of them have been trained a lot uh, this uh, previous week and we shall see who gets the better start and it seems Borealis is gonna take his first turn with the medic and let's see if he can find the enemy orderly and for the match he can. told us he hopes that uh, Cypher will start uh, Root Canal, which is uh, strange to me. <laughs> like, you won't uh, start on Root Canal, it's heavily medic-based uh, map. And meanwhile, the second map is over the top, where being player one is uh, not important. So, strange, wow. strange. Depends, maybe Borealis has some uh, trick up his sleeve that he's been trying, because I know he's been... Uh, playing with uh, Metal Man and also he's been playing with Iron Fox lately okay. so definitely he maybe found out a tactic where he could destroy the basically he could do the cold front thing where he destroys the enemy artillery in turn one well but I no idea down. about that but oh. I think uh, it can be also possibility that he finds preserving medic on medic uh, a hard task to do, and he wants no additional risks on uh, map one. No idea. Mm -hmm. Well, we have some very decent damage from Boralis. Uh, yeah, actually, it was super here. damage. Like ninety-eight. You rarely see those. Yeah. Very good uh, lineup. He's going for the body block on the scout, and he's gonna try for a long range uh, cluster grenade. So let's see. That looks decent. Perfect. And that, yeah, that was absolutely perfect. It's interesting to see him being on 22 HP and body blocking scout. Like. It's setting up yourself on uh, skipping a turn. It would be cool to see him go into the water, drop into 15, but he can still deal double damage to Grenadier and Scout and like... That way he will prevent uh, skip turn ever happening and also he will... Wow, it's not slippery. Have you seen? Oh, now it is slippery, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and also that way he can reduce his amount of picks. So next round it will be 4 picks against 5. So I would strongly suggest to just damage that scout grandier body block. Yeah, probably would have been a better turn, but uh, I mean still that grenadier is on 15 HP, so he can be taken care of. No, no, with, I mean uh, Cypher Grenadier. Cypher's, uh, Scout, I believe, if he has one. Yeah, he has two he scouts. Even two. And we see some MoMA separation. I mean, he did it clean, but I'm not sure if it will work out. Oh, last oh, second bazooka, let's see. It's still possible, but... Good menuing. Let's ah. see. Alright, okay. Okay, kinda. Kinda. He only lost 4 HP on his bazooka, so it uh, it was how much? 60... 96 damage turn? Yeah. Pretty okay. Very good damage on the order leader. So no. let's see how Borealis will retaliate, and I think yeah, it's gonna be a simple shrapnel grenade. Let's see if he's gonna target the paratrooper. Or oh. the... Oh, he's going for a hard shrapnel with body block. Uh, what is this turn like? It's not stable, it's just... 
If it's 30, you got nobody to blame but yourself. Like, what is it? It's kind of 40 something HP. 43, turn. yeah. Okay, like, not terrible, but from engineer you want more. Like, it would be perfect to, for example, uh, body block uh, paratrooper with medic with a single TNT or even that scout. If you are not sure which scout is taking turn, yeah, you are doing it with paratrooper, you are placing TNT, combining medic paratrooper, next turn, double damage, something like that. At least it got sense <laughs> in your gameplay. Meanwhile, this turn is like shrapnel from very strange angle, like your chances to succeed greatly reduced doing that. Oh, yep. barely. Oh. Oh, I thought that was a double poison, but no, actually. All right, let's see. Is this gonna be just a simple poison? Yes, it is. And imagine it's double. If he can make it double, he, he would need a perfect angle to s just skin across, uh, skin across the river. But no, that's a wait. Oh. Oh. oh, if only, if only. I think if he had more power, he would have skipped a little higher and it would get to the enemy orderly. This right now is game defining turn. Uh, safer shoot, skip medic turn somehow. He can do 5 head jump, like not 5, 4 head jumps and knife, but he is doing it hard way. Uh, with, yeah. uh, that actually, if, if he detonates way too early, he's not gonna skip. If he detonates way too late, it's gonna kill the orderly. Yeah, he got very little window of mistake. Like, he can lose the game right now. If he will <laughs> fail with this. Okay. And yep, late detonation, meaning orderly is down, and that opens up Coralis's chances to... Yeah, huge chances. Like, if he's get. killing Medic, he will get a skip turn. It's too much of advantage and probably Borealis is taking up one. Yeah, definitely... Kill the Medic. Okay. Oh, please, go oh, okay. It's already victory for Borealis after that. Like, oh. huge advantage. I think it's way too soon to call that, but... Uh, yeah. There is gonna be the orderly, there is gonna be the grenadier out, and. Oh out my! He <laughs> has all, almost all of the jetpacks. So if he gets him to not. Oh yeah, okay, that's. I think, yeah, you called it right, that's gonna be a game. And he's going for the Beautiful. water skip as well. Very yeah, but it is solid. From I, like I lost game to ADB in uh, previous league just like that. I was trying to skip turn, but I was player one, so it was ridiculous for me. From Cipher, it was do or die situation, uh, and yeah, deciding which weapon to use. It's always hard. Four head jumps sh would be like the best decision for him, or he can cross the river and try to like poison his grenadier and additional pick that would be less devastating than just killing let's see what cypher no, does now because he's kind of running out of options he still uh Borel still has that scout he has a paratrooper he has a sapper and this grenadier which is on 15 hp yeah uh... i think he's just gonna do a cattle prod into the water and that's gonna be a turn I wonder if it was possible to machine gun Grandier and someone else. I think it, it was probably an option, yeah. Maybe but, yes, but uh, right now he positioned himself quite poorly where he can just take a yeah. TNT and if he gets an unlucky spin he can drown very much. But a huge Borealis possibility for Borealis, just... I see, is collecting crates and just dealing damage. For Cypher, it's poison game. Mm -hmm. Well, I think... Oh, yeah. He probably wanted to put that grenade so he would stop at, like, 16 HP. And maybe he could line up a double poison, but this mm -hmm. scout has its turn right now. 
Right to the left is uh, homing missile, which is like not needed, I think. It's so so great. This one is a bit better. No, let's yeah. say a lot better, like air burst. So yeah. double poison should be implemented right now. Uh, not the best, but let's see. Uh, you need a lot of power to perform shot like that, because it can easily roll somewhere else. Yeah, it will roll. Oh, but he, but oh, he, he still succeeded. Got it. Okay. Yeah. Very needed. Yeah, he's gonna collect the homing missile and probably go for the double poison as well because, uh, like, why mm -hmm. wouldn't he? It's it's just free. Uh, he can poison the scout and also kill the paratrooper. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> yeah, that was a little finicky movement from Borealis right there, but yeah, that's Paratrooper down. And Cypher is down to his last scout, which is still full HP, and yeah, one, one more scout, which is poisoned, and 31 HP, I believe. Mm, yeah, something like that. I think he is going to collect that, that crate and probably poison, poison, poison. He can also replace himself uh, under... Mine coming crate, yes, he's doing it. Let's see if it's correct position, because I got no idea, I don't remember. Yeah, 31 HP, as I saw. Oh, okay. Focusing scout. We have a long range shot, which is nice. Borealis will probably push him <laughs> outside the mine dropping zone, but... Uh, he's gonna go for the skip onto the crate. Which at, you will get. At least this one, I mean, uh, position oh. undermine, creating a diverse situation. Because right now, Borealis should have uh, skipped another scout turn. I think it was 31 or something like that. Yep. So, this right here prevented Cypher from skipping a turn. It draws attention from. Look at that. So, it was kinda a. Uh, Brain games, mind games with Borealis. I don't think it's enough, but it's a good touch. Oof. It's time for Airburst suicide. What is he doing? Oh, he's planning to do one more turn. It's optimistical, to be honest. Yeah, he's putting himself in a range where he can't exactly be skipped with any weapon. It would be perfect to stay on the boots. That way it's only kill or nothing. But at this position I think it's easy to deal 5 head jumps. I've never seen air burst like that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and uh, Scout is coughing, so that's probably under 20 HP. Maybe I even in the I think he was on 61. No? I think he was on 61. Uh, so right now... Some... No, oh, it's 15. Okay. Sorry, sorry. Uh, no, Borealis. <laughs> Demons in oh, his head. No, 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 no. You wow, know he's wasted last his time. Turn. What is that? Uh, why? <laughs> why? What, what why is that? You... Oh, that's never gonna work, my guy. L let's You're just let's killing see. Your own okay, pig. let's see. Uh, it's probably like demons in his head, but if it works. No, it's not. Nope, it doesn't. Because he. Tried the same on uh, Nightfall with uh, Fab. And you know what? And, Next and he turn. made him skip. Yeah. Next turn, it would be Paratrooper on the other side, so he cannot um, jump on uh, Scout Head. So this Scout will get another turn in which he can, uh, like, poison himself with, uh, or probably, what, uh, grenade launcher himself. Like, Borealis is choking hard, and poison game can be enough, like, Cypher was losing a lot, but right now, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, I think for Borealis was just uh, overthinking everything a little bit now. And... Wait, 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 wait! Oh! <laughs> what? Okay. All right, this needs to be a wake-up call for Borealis right now. Yeah, 1-0, wake up on over the top, friend. 
Whoa. To be honest, uh, I think mine and probably cattle prod and machine gun, like couple weapons that can do this. Like they will make uh, enough power to throw somebody out of bounds, but not enough to like give them that additional speed, you know. Yeah. Is it enough? Wow, oh, he's one HP short. This is the most self-choke I've seen so far on this league. And the worst part is that he can just kill himself with a grenade launcher, take like... Borealis with him, and his sapper is poisoned, so this can still be... Oh my, he's going for some head jumps. Like, just think about that. Why do you need to head jump the scout this turn? Like, just why? He's not going anywhere. Max he can do to you if you run away. It's 30 HP with grenade launcher. So, like, why are you skipping your turn doing that? It, like, it's zero sense. You just need to run to the other side and damage someone else. Like, the scout. And, and that I... guy will skip turn. In like yeah. two turns, so. Oh, don't do that! No. Oh, amount and of that's choke. Gonna be GG. And you were so optimistic for. But uh, to be honest, uh, he's right because Cipher got mine. It's. Uh, oh, he can maybe TNT him up, but that's gonna oh. be. That's gonna have to be a one in a million shot. To be honest, Shrapnel is better at one. those things, but let's see. It can pretty much be Borealis game. Yeah, I was very confident, but the yeah, amount of mistakes you can make in this game. Okay, Borealis, GG. As predicted, Michael, as predicted. <sighs> Man. <laughs> so many twisted turns and yeah, it, it felt like Borealis was playing against himself for half of the time. Uh, not the I best choice of words, but yeah. <laughs> Borealis junked his way, or should I say jerked his way to the victory, and we will see you on map 2, which is over the top. And welcome everybody back, 8 second map between Borealis and Cypher, still Michael with me. Yep. And over the top, updated with artilleries and a uh, bunch of new crates, I think. I think. Uh, probably not, but artilleries are new, uh, they have been utilized in Grand League, now in Middle League. Uh, map is uh, refreshed and we will see how players will approach this. I was training a lot with Cypher, couple games with Borealis and I think they are going to do uh, one shot from the spawn. By the way... While you were mentioning that uh, this map changed a lot in the uh, now, uh, what really changed? Like, what were the major changes, or what do you remember about the last uh, map? Uh, like back in the days when Over the Top was old version, not beta version of uh, campaign map. Uh, yep. There were no water, <laughs> obviously. Uh, oh. It was very different game. Water was just their, like, pattern <laughs> on texture pattern and that's all. Nowadays, mm -hmm. it's dangerous to go to the middle. Oh, oh 90. 90, good damage. And it's gonna give uh, Borealis' gunner a little boost. <laughs> anyway, about the crates, we are gonna have a lot of uh, mortars, some roller wait, grenades, and wait, wait, also wait. air Focus, focus on this shot. It can be out of bounds. If he, it can be out of bounds. Let's oh, see. Oh, oh, he practice. Yeah. And from my knowledge, those out of bounds are like there are four, five types of out of bounds. Goodbye. And that's a supper down. I think this is start of downhill of this map, cause. Honestly, from what I've seen uh, from training sessions, there are not much safe spots on this map, so mo uh, artilleries will be probably gun, <laughs> to be honest. No idea. Yeah. Maybe maybe if the artilleries could be tweaked a little bit, or something uh, like decrease their range or uh, effectiveness, but 
Yeah, oh. I don't it's, think that's. It's not happen. Dota 2. <laughs> 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 yep. <laughs> also, notice how I. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no, nice <mic>. 50. <laughs> And Borealis looks like he's gonna, gonna Borealis go wanted for to a... start this map. Am I right? Yeah. But we've seen even as player two, it's completely possible to make out of bounds. Oh, I think I know why he wanted to start because this was supposed to be his uh, third turn with the gunner, which means first turn he would do a out of bounds kill on some pig. Mm -hmm. Second turn he would damage the mm -hmm. artillery with something. And on the third turn with the gunner, he would basically, he practiced the way up to the artillery. Uh, and I think he wanted to just destroy it like this with the flamethrower. Uh, that was it. That was his plan. Honestly, I think it's overcomplicating because nah, you cannot predict spawn. So yeah, it's good that you can uh, use flamethrower, but it's not guaranteed. So let's see. He needed perfect one. 47 is not that good. Cypher is in deep trouble. Yeah, he got so damaged that's... artillery, minus one pick. Uh, yeah, huge trouble for him. Yeah, pick that didn't even get a turn off, so... Mm -hmm. Crazy. Well, he's gonna pick up the mortars on his scout and... Uh, looks like, yeah, he's gonna try to I, Is it a... also trained? Like, look at the precision of the angle. It's not the usual angle. Wow. Borealis oh is really prepared. Okay. Poison was not applied, and Cypher is lucky for that. He was... Probably it's a gas tick or something like that, or Cypher was closer to the mountain than usual. But it just shows you the level of preparation by... Uh, by... Borealis, by Borealis. Yeah, he's been treating the middle league... Uh, very seriously. Very seriously, yes, very. Uh, from the Gra Grand League, I think he learned his lesson where he was... Uh, I think underestimating some of his opponents or the games that he would have to play. And it really showed in his semif Ooh. semifinals. Look at that. Oh no, it's bad. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> but water. Oh. A ridiculous water of over the top. Yep. Yeah, honestly, Borealis is just crushing. Uh, right now he got huge advantage. And uh, I mean he still has some strong opponents to face uh, even for in example. the playoffs. So but I still think that Borealis is a very strong contender for at least top 3 in the middle league. Yeah, it's all about morale, it's about preparation, it's about luck and... Okay, good one. Decent shot. I think he will probably get, yeah, another turn with artillery and he should oh. utilize it correctly. Probably either poison shell or... Uh, I don't know. Oh, yeah, definitely poison shell. Oh, oh, no, 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 he's going for a normal shot. Okay, okay, I guess. I'm not sure if poison shell can hit both of them. But, okay. I think he is gonna try to get uh, the scout to the water and make him slide too long. Let's okay. see. Straight to the middle. Uh, I uh, guess. Hmm. It works. Let's see. Uh, he's basically sitting on a 6 HP bomb. So hmm. that paratrooper is quite in a pickle, I would say. Let's see uh, what uh, Borealis I would say is. 6 HP is like a good situation for him. Like he will get only 40 because of destruction, but opponent actually need to spend that turn, so it's not the bad outcome for him. Alright, now Borealis will finally apply the poison that he was trying to get on that. Oh, oh that was a preset position. Yeah, seems like preset, because it was very precise. Um, 
why is the red health bar is so big? Mm, good question. Probably, probably because, because the uh, shots that happened. Probably yes, and also uh, oh. gray peak right now is just focusing artillery. He's spending like how much? Two, three turns already, just focusing artillery. And he has still yet to kill it, so... Alright, but Borealis will get his turn on the artillery finally. Let's see... Oh hmm. yeah, uh, Cypher's picks are still, still very healthy. And the worst part is that Borealis doesn't have uh, any picks that he can attack on his side, so... He can't utilize the... 100 pound shell or any close range shells at all. Hmm. Very interesting match. Uh, I feel like Borealis is really powerful in terms of how he dominates this game, but uh, it's only moral uh, aspect of the game. Meanwhile, we see Hell's Bar and Cypher got huge advantage. The only problem for him will be artillery. And uh, the state of his poisoned peak, uh, peaks. But I think right now it's only Paratrooper who is poisoned, so he can work with it. Yeah. Well, Very good damage. Be... It's almost a kill, I would say. Oh, now, now we have that 3 HP gunner. Let's see what he does. Yeah, he's focusing on the artillery. Which is very good decision. Oh, he's not. What? No, he is. Oh, he is. But uh, let's let's hope he doesn't kill himself with it this shot. It seems like a good shot. So, I uh, should be right on the top. Oof, oof, oof. Oh, only twenty HP. So, oh. staying in artillery is good decision. Yeah, it looks like it. I think Borealis has focused a little too much on what he planned and not what is happening at the moment, so... No, honestly, destroying artillery is a way to win. Uh, I just uh, wonder if it will be enough, uh, his artillery play. Yeah, for sure he one-shotted uh, his opponent. It was like... I'm not sure who, probably engineer, so it's like 150 HP a turn. But then he missed a turn, so it's like only 75 HP efficiency of artillery. Oh, it's gonna be a turn skip setup for uh, Cypher. And uh, let's see. No. <laughs> oh, what are you doing, my guy? Probably he's trying to climb, but he needs to learn the pattern. Yeah, Borealis is a very competitive oh. guy, I would say. I really enjoy his approach. Like he's learning a lot, he's practicing a lot, and he's like. Constantly trying to get better. Yeah, that gunner is quite in a position where he could be attacked by the artillery slow shots. Mm -hmm. I would say so... it's hard task. Like, so much water you can easily miss and shooting from that artillery is not an easy task. Yeah, that is very much true, but... Uh, we got very tasty if... weapons right there. Yeah, and that's gonna be the 3 HP gunner taken care of. And right now... Let's Dude, see. crates! What are you doing? Crates behind you! He's just gonna ignore the airstrikes or airbursts, sorry. Airburst, yeah. And mortar. I think I if know. you climb on that hill it's bazooka, but in the trenches it's, it's mortar. Uh, this one. I think it's mortar. Mm. Oh no! Wrong turn count. Mm. Wait, he's not skipping that guy? Uh, oh, oh. oh, he's probably gonna try to get that airburst on top. No. But he sees he's very slow, so he's just... Oh. Oh, what are you doing? Why is he... He leaving that gunner alive. That's a weird decision. 
Weird, weird. But that's a clean 50. And that's about it. So health bar health wise Cypher is still in the lead. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the most interesting part of the game is when ground hawks, like hawks outside of the artillery will be dead and uh, we will see the impact of poison and how Cypher will try to destroy enemy artillery. It's This game is far from um, unfolding completely. Well, it seems like... Let's see, that shot seems very nice. Very hard to judge. I wanted to, but I just stopped my brain. Fright. Oh, okay. and he's gonna drown. Okay. Uh, was there any crates in that pick? Uh, I think not. Oh, he's gonna try for that 100 pound shell on the parasol. Is it enough, though? Is it enough? Uh, it might not... No. So, his artillery efficiency is like 50 HP a turn right now, with two misses. And why are you not focusing that gunner who is standing? Like, he, he is poisoned, he is already up for skipping a turn. I don't know, like... Once again... Probably not enough experience from Borealis. Like, we've, uh, we've seen huge and beautiful decisions, but then again, sometimes he's just mm, not performing to the to his best. Is this the time? Probably. I it think, is. yeah, it is definitely the time because that's the last ground pick that he had. Oh, no. Except the scout. Oh, that yeah. could be a D9 triple poison. Both of them are doing huge mistakes. So he baited Cypher. Wow, he is a master of hawks. It's not a mistake if you if you were not punished for it. So wow, Borealis. Okay, let's see if this shot will be. Oh, oh my! And a bunch up. Maybe water. Yeah, oh, that's and just water. too good. And also I kill! Oh my god. Okay. Honestly, like... Probably it was not the best decision, leaving the gunner alive, in terms of, like, uh, computer level of understanding the game, but in human versus human, when everybody is making mistakes, it can pretty much be a beautiful bait. And... What a player, honestly. Yeah, let's see. Right now, Cypher is gonna. Oh, he's gonna try to get Herbert's the artillery? Uh, yes. He got so much mortars around him, and he's using that close, uh, close range weapon too. I mean, it's decent damage, so probably okay. Hey, he's on. A lot less than he was previously. I think Bora, that this <laughs> is a really hard position to hit Cypher's pig and with... Ah, that's not gonna cut it. 30 damage efficiency. Every turn this artillery deals 30 damage. Yeah. And the worst part is that it dealt a lot less damage than, on average, uh, did uh, Cypher's. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Cypher used uh, 90 HP, 1000 pound shell, and also that beautiful turn with two peaks damaged. Yeah. What was it, like 42 and no, 26? Ah, yeah, yeah, and combined something like 70 plus water. Yeah. Very good mortar. So, you know, it's a strategy to leave artillery alive and bait for such mistakes. It's funny how probably some of those choices, they are not from a good place, they are from mistakes and, I don't know, not understanding the game fully, but... Wow, this best of three is just inspiring. It's just perfect competitive match. Some mistakes, some uh, comebacks, crazy, out of bounds, and also out of bounds. Oh, oh, wait. What was that? 
probably a control issue. His angle was not moving. So to explain what happened, we've clearly seen uh, Borealis uh, angle just stopping. It was because of safe stator that popped up and uh, I decided to uh, let him do this shot. Because it, it was clearly stuttering on the screen. I think it's only fair. Not influencing uh, the minds of players, I think, <laughs> too much. But, you know, those small pauses can always do damage to your concentration. We'll see. Alright. And we can see that Cypher already thought of his new move, or next move. Which is gonna be... Scout is 29, though. So... Yeah. Probably... Damage was done. With that pass. Oh. Or he's setting his... Uh, the scout for... For, for, for... For jetpack. I don't know. Oh, is he just ignoring that? Yes. But oh. I, I think you kinda should. Oh, 38... Uh, uh, probably no. <laughs> they are so bunched up, so... Okay. Combining oh. efforts... Oh. Totally not needed risk, but okay. Quite unnecessary if he was 29, I think. Yeah, I mean, flying uh, up to the hill. Now the game started. Artillery is gone and Cypher got so much healthy picks. The game would be very different if uh, Borealis uh, would make uh, good and shots. And he's also gonna slip down. But that artillery dealt something like 30 average per turn. Mm. So, that's gonna be a 110 non-poisoned paratrooper. Mm -hmm. And he's gonna collect some crates. Let's see if it will actually be worth it. Because Borealis, if he wants to win this match, is gonna need to deal some serious damage. And I think he's You're betting on right? the... He's betting on his bazooka. Which will fail him a little bit. I would fly to that paratrooper and try to, you know, deal some damage with jetpacks, but overall just to eliminate my picks. Yeah. But oh. no, he's not going. Which is, you know, not a mistake, I guess. Oh! <laughs> you were saying? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. He's going to 15, but it's a mistake, you're playing against Paratrooper. The only way he can make you skip is via jetpack, but it requires precision, and it can be a bait for mistakes, so I would say stay at 18 or Oh, that was a so good much. shot. Still. Yes, yes. And lately, Cypher was very, I would say, low morale on this map. He was constantly saying, like, it's impossible for me to shoot good or something like that. And you see, competitive game and everything is good. The difference between training mentality and competitive mentality. Yeah. Definitely. And we might see a quick shot from Borealis here if he can make something happen. He's gonna probably do a panic air burst. Is Gunner skipping? Because is he, if he's skipping, it's over? Oh, yep, he's definitely skipping. I think it's over. <laughs> is it? The Poison Paratrooper has still 15 HP and two jetpacks. Well, yeah, but his efficiency is greatly decreased. It would be very hard for Cypher to win this game. It can be 2-0, let's see. If you're he, watching he, this he video... He can still tie. <laughs> if you... You are watching this video, tell me how much duration is left. <laughs> you will tell who, who clutched and who didn't. Yep. Alright, oh, that's... Oh! Oh, nice, 40. To be honest, okay, Cypher can still win. If this pick is dead, yeah. 
Other Peak got immense amount of jetpacks. No, like, he has exactly two and on. No, 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 don't die. Okay, no, three. What are you saying? Okay. So, probably self killing is the best decision if you are nervous, but you can still win it. One more jetpack and bazooka, and game is done. Let's see. Okay, it's probably 1-1. One, one. <laughs> okay, he clutched somehow. But bazooka self damage, it's always happening for new guys. Let's see, tension is high. And... Is it? He is nope. new! Best of three champion! Oh my god. 4 HP, poisoned, Calculate. but still standing. Wow, what a poetic ending from Michael! Yeah. <laughs> what a release. Do, 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 do. And he's not skipping the cutscene. Mental pressure. Wow. He's, oh. he's stating a point. Yeah, he's exactly getting one point. We are moving to Aqua Base. Probably even more ridiculous map. And this best of three is huge. Yeah. Let's see which piggy wants to take a bath this time. You're watching map 3 of interesting competition between Borealis and Cypher. It's Michael, Revan and Middle League group stage, week 3. Yay. <laughs> so, what a conclusion to map 2. Like, over the top, they really did go over the top to entertain us and right now aqua base the peak of british game design and uh, yeah tanks pillboxes medics whoever gets first turn gets advantage let's see yep let's see who has more luck this time around and it is gonna be drum roll do 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 uh, oh <laughs> Hmm, where could the enemy para um, medic be? Okay, yesterday I did an experiment. We were playing with Cypher on Aqua Base. I also was the first pick, but instead of tranquilizing, I went to Pillbox. So the idea was, it was not my, ide my idea to start with, but I wanted to test it. What if you can hide your medic and heal like some picks? When it's your turn. I've never been so horribly trashed. Uh, wait. He's shooting okay. ground. Okay. I've never been so horribly trashed, so never hide your medic always. Tranquilize. Ah, mm. we got a phrase from the pick. Mm, yes, phrase we couldn't hear because it's file tree. Hype. All right, so we will have some jetpack action. Where from... is he pushing him? Is that water? Um, hidden water somewhere. What is going on? Uh, probably not. Probably he's just gonna turn around and try to do a. What? What, what is the idea? Out of bounds? Like what? Probably not. Damaging his own tank? That's why he's pushing him away? I guess... I don't know. Hey, still 80 damage. The question is, will they fly for the tanks? Both of them got two paratroopers. Those tanks are pretty easy to catch, but we got two of them on separated islands. And what will be the decision? Using that mortar would be the worst decision you could make, definitely. Yes. So this is definitely not a. Uh... Oh my. And also a very weird angle. Like this is completely player mistake. If you're playing this map, you know. You need to position tank differently. Uh, decisions, decisions for cipher. Uh, probably pillbox a good idea. Yeah. Yes. Gunner is generally not very useful. Big here, so uh, do you think he can still make this shot and not hit his own sapper? Yeah, definitely. Look okay. at that. 
Uh, right between the eyes, it seems. But, I mean... No, I don't think so, but... Hmm, yeah, it's safe. You baited me into thinking it's, it's dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> is he flying for tank, or is he... Uh, in this position, it's very hard to e efficiently separate them. Yeah, look at that. Very hard. Yeah. I mean, I mean he separated them all right, yeah. But uh, Medic is still in secure position. And he's instead going for the sapper, sending him over the building. Mm-hmm. So you consider fences buildings? Well, I see a weird texture and I don't know what they are, so I'm gonna tell... call them whatever I want. <laughs> <laughs> if you have, like, professional probably... terminology for uh, <laughs> commentators, I mean, send me the sheet and I'll learn it. <laughs> uh, it was sent in admin chat, I don't know why you are not prepared. Oh. <laughs> okay. But they okay. probably okay. So your defense, they probably uh, flagged as buildings in game code. So you are more professional than me. Uh, not exactly buildings, but like structures, I guess. Oh, sorry, Mister Game Developer. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh, is he going to dispose of Honestly, the... Shrapnel is a good idea here, kinda. I, I like Shrapnel, like he's standing above and usually it's kinda easier to release Shrapnel. Ooh, oof, 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 oh, oof. nervous. Slid down. He's really nervous, look at that. Yeah. Like it's uh, such a, I don't know, such a huge mistake from nowhere. Basically. 30 damage is pretty much how much he dealt with artillery, so I'm asking Varialis, do you want to self artillery shot on aqua base? Probably he's saying no, but you know, best of three, last map, you are not first player, it can be heavy on morale. A uh, wet TNT incoming? Mm, mm. Nah, he's gonna move okay. back a little bit. Yeah, that's gonna be the medic down, and yeah, no more chances for any tranks or a heals from Borealis. Great, great. Borealis right now, uh, very hard game, obviously. He's not doing efficient turns, his medic is uh, out of the game, and uh, Cypher got uh, like... Tank, pillbox, a lot of armor. So, I really don't have an answer to the question what he is supposed to do, otherwise that turn, Kenan Medic. Uh, probably flying with paratroopers for tanks, like for additional HP. Oh my. Oh, he's gonna survive. And he's going to spin. tranquilize. Or probably even enter the tank and use Medic for healing. Yeah, both that would variants. be smarter, probably. Mm -hmm. I would say both variants are good, but... Yeah. Staying on the island, it's very hard to deal with him. Oh, he is opting to go into the water instead. I would watch Borealis safer all day, to be honest. Like, such a great uh, set of games. Yeah, they're definitely both on the at the same skill level, I would say. It's yeah, yeah. Not, not like a very one-sided game or like the other games uh, used to be, like where uh, even the yeah, score was 2-0. Yes. But yeah, this is actually like fighting to the very end with both players. Let's see if Cypher can get his angle. Or not the Borealis, sorry. Alright. Probably it can be better if that shell would push him outside, but still, decent. Yeah. Now this tank is completely out of battlefield and... Yeah, slowly, slowly. 
My biggest issue with these tanks is their speed and I suppose it's like correct choice in terms of game balance and game design. Otherwise you can cross map with 150 HP protection, but still, you know, it's not very pleasant to, to play with such a uh, slow vehicle. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Oh, decent shot. Oh, 15 HP. Uh, I mean, I don't know why am I even looking at HP, because uh, they, no, none of the players no have... Points scouts so a and no poison damage on this map so yeah everything will be just raw damage mm. okay, that's Michael. a very long swim let's see i got no idea who to focus probably yeah that pick because he is out of mm, you know oh. steel oh another one Okay. Super. Wow, that HP advantage. And being Borealis, what are you supposed to do? You need to kill, kill medic some, somehow, the tank that medic is sitting in. But how? Like 150 HP in one turn. Probably it's shrapnel plus something, but it's still not an answer. Like you're wasting two turns to remove a medic remove healing it's the right choice but meanwhile your opponent is just crushing you and to be honest medic can he will damage uh, aqua tank but medic will just re-enter the pillbox he will heal and enter the pillbox yeah uh, there's not really much he can do except just trying to whittle down the tank to a better number. Uh, 6 HP. Hmm. Good choice. Uh, you need to focus engineers so they cannot damage your vehicles. And he got pillbox, two tanks. Great choice. For Borealis, after that engineer will die, ah, what are you gonna do? Yeah, he is just smothering him. And he is he also trying to damage that paratrooper? Okay. Oh. Oh, five HP on there. Okay. But very good attempt, because I was not seeing that. Okay, at least he can finish medic with those uh, jetpacks. Mm -hmm. Timer is an issue though. Yeah, that's definitely gonna be a bit of an issue, but... Hopefully he can make something happen. Oh, oh never mind. I swear, it will be not 40. Like... Even with direct hit, I don't know, some Hawks bullshit, 39, even like that. Or a wet yeah. bazooka. He got one more turn, but still. So painful to commentate, like, I'm trying to figure out how Borealis can come back, but it seems like on this map, mm, so hard to do it. With all the yeah. tanks. You're basically locked to damaging vehicles while your pigs got destroyed. Maybe capturing them early is an answer, but sometimes you need to do other things, like for Borealis it was separating medics, otherwise you will not win <laughs> this game, so no idea. Badum! Yep. 43, which is putting him in a very awkward spot where he needs to get out of the water. And maybe even out of the vehicle entirely, but... Oh, it can be TNT plus tank destruction. Oh. Yeah. Possibly. Let's see if we can make something good happen. I would say he, he will push him not very efficiently, but still, still, still. 
Good turn, good damage. Oof. Never mind, with that bounce. Bounce was not expected from my side. Yep. Very, very nice bounce. And that supper is gone. That leaves the medic, which is. Medic be cannot good. heal anyone, right? Yeah. Everybody is vehicled. Yeah, uh, he has, uh, I think, paratrooper in the tank. Then he has a gunner, which is full HP in the pillbox. Mm -hmm. Yes. Which means he can just go ahead and do some damage. Probably or even tank, tank if he still knows who's going next. And you know uh, what is funny? He collected all weapons on that separated uh, island. And since Borealis got no poison damage, uh, he cannot really steal those weapons. And Medic is 15, so obviously. So those weapons like Mortar and Rocket Launcher, which he collected on the island, will be at safer disposal, even after medic, uh, Medic's death. It's uh, also a huge advantage. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's see, does he... I still has one jetpack, he could use that jetpack to either get this guy to the water or finish off that 15 HP guy. But I think water will be a better option. Michael, I got a very serious question. What? But you need to, like, you need to really think about it. Why hawks are farting while exiting the tank? Um. <laughs> My idea. I, I, I would rather not answer that question. <laughs> Due to, you know, uh, Budget cuts in Hawks army, they got so limited space in the tanks that they are basically in constant uh, pressure. They can barely sit in, in those, and when they are exiting, they got that relaxation. Release. Uh, mm -mm. Nah, that doesn't sit right with me. I think the why such thing is happening is because of the military food. Uh -huh. They usually serve beans, and you know how it goes with beans. Yeah, but how is it connected <laughs> to tanks? Uh, I don't know, they just use it, use it as an ejecting mechanism. Ah, Michael, you still got much to do. What do you mean? <laughs> and meanwhile, Cypher is on his way to destroy Aquatank with mortar. All crowd yep. is in silence. Pressure is at maximum level. And... Ah, he got it. Alright, this paratrooper is gonna take out the medic. We got him. Yeah. But careful, pillbox is Cattle open. Cattle brought to the water, let's go. Mm. Pillbox Sage. is open. Nobody wants to be there. Nice 40. Little bit of an awkward spin, but... Weapons, weapons, here I come. He's not coming for them. No, he's not coming. Ah, uh, please come for the weapons. Please collect them. Mm, nope. Good <laughs> <Okay>. night. <laughs> Psych, you fought. <laughs> oh. He's Fuck not one. even slow, yeah, so. Nyam nyam mortars. And he's also. Okay. Mortars overrated. What? Uh, he believe? He believes. Oh, he's gonna use special ops. Trust. In your house. <laughs> no, he's gonna go to the pillbox. Uh, uh, oh, do something! <laughs> okay, it should be 110. 
110 reasons not to use sharpness like that. Uh, baited to, to the pillbox. Masterful. Both of the players are really good at bait. <gasps> Wait, uh, oh, head jump. Double shot, no? Is it possible? Probably not, but... Uh... Oh, Joey, this is gonna go... No, I think oh. it's possible. Not like that, of course. Um, yeah. Oh, well. Borealis is down to his last living paratrooper. And Cypher has pillbox and, and uh, aqua tank. Mm -hmm. My criticism of this map is it's very long. Like, obviously, you need to destroy That's tanks, pillboxes. Said, but yes. Yeah. <laughs> and also, it got no music. So you, you are stuck in that, like, waiting while you get enough damage to kill vehicles. Meanwhile, like, you are just cheating in silence. Uh, I, I mean, it's a... It's a way to play it by... But... Hmm. Not, not sure, not sure. Is he gonna switch the, to the mm. other tank, or...? You know, he's kind of giving Borealis the possibility to swim a little and enter the tank. Oh, oh, that's oh, that's good, that's good. Like the the fact that he was switching to mortar-like shot, this is good. The execution is <laughs> not great. Look at that. If Safer will clutch this shot, he will end the game immediately. Because the amount of water behind those is crazy. But if Borealis will be able to enter the tank, he will get chances. I'm not sure if this is enough to win the game, but at least he will prolong it. So let's go, Cypher. Good mortar, just like in simulations. And Borealis need to really dodge this, so... Well, he, he's not moving, he can't No, 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 really he, he needs this, to but... dodge it. If he is not dodging it, it's a mistake, of course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that big mountain is gonna sure make this shot a little hard. He's not so big behind those peaks, you know. Tiny peak in a huge mm -hmm. world. Don't, don't, full don't of finish suffering. that. Don't finish that sentence. Okay. Borealis played his opponent. His opponent was not able to shot uh, to shoot. Oh. He got less uh, healthy aqua tank, which is understandable. Oh, don't do that. <laughs> well, this is just gonna be a fight of straight shots. Seems like. I would do the same, just <laughs> shoot with... <laughs> Actually, shoot with uh, with Bazooka. If he will not move, come here with the gunner and use flamethrower. And then he will be out of uh, out of aqua tank, near water and, you know. Yeah. Ah, oh, it's a mist... Okay, he's moving closer, so he will not be... Uh... He will probably hit himself. Yes. Mm -hmm. Is it possible for him to be influenced by influence uh, by flamethrower? Be damaged by flamethrower? Uh, I would try flamethrower even now. Please flamethrower. Oh no! Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> I think this game is not going as the, you would like it to see. Badum. Ah, oh, he's probably gonna try to use this tank as This is why you needed uh, fla- Actually, Borealis can clutch it to the victory. Uh, that was a mistake from Cypher. Oh, he still has an airburst as well. Oh, joy. It can be a huge mistake by Cypher. Wow, if Borealis will clutch it, 
Uh, uh, no, 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 Borealis. It's not enough. Please use air burst. Oh. Uh, well. Amount of choke in those games. Uh, right. So. Honestly, um, you can even do rocket launcher to the like to the bottom of your legs and it will be enough. Just push him to the water. Oh, he's just gonna give him the all push. Choke artists. Both of them. Yeah. Uh let's see. Oh. Oh, he didn't really give Borealis uh, much of an option to stand <laughs> anywhere. Oh, that's the edge of the map, and that... Oh, yeah. I mean, Cypher still got advantage on um, HP, but he's really pressured with those shots. Ah, oh, look at that. Pressure is building. Yeah, he got... Not much place to stand on, Borealis, but it's also not much place to land a mortar, if you're not precise. Yeah. I mean, if if he just lands it on, on top of that hill, it can at least do a shrapnel, so at least some damage would be Okay, in this the game. seems good. This seems good. Ah! Uh, oh my god. Exactly 50. GG to Cypher, GG to Borealis, it's, it was very entertaining game, and 69 Gunner, <laughs> just to nice. prove just a point. Chef's kiss. <laughs> Nobody is kissing, only a heart rocking of his opponent. I would say Borealis seemed to me, especially on the middle of map 2, like after the instant kill he was he seemed like unstoppable force to be honest and cypher seemed like he was really nervous and not ready to win but then he clutched the victory on the second map and this one i think it's fair to say it was fully controlled and the point when borealis was not able to kill scout of uh, scout uh, medic of cypher it survived uh, it created you know that unpleasant situation that you need to solve somehow Crazy game, and yeah, yeah. first Both points for Both players showed uh, a lot of skill, and... How yeah, much? It's... What? How much skill they showed? Why do you have to question... Enough for the <laughs> middle league! I make? <laughs> and we will get back to you in another match. See you around. Yeah, take care.